Hi class. Today we'll learn how to write a program using Tinkercad such that red LED will blink 10 times and then green LED will blink 10 times. Each time the LED blinks, I want the blink number to be displayed on the serial monitor. We will be connecting the red LED to pin 2 of the Arduino and green LED to pin 3. Now I will go to tinkercad.com, go to circuits, click on create new circuit. Search for Arduino, place the Arduino in the schematic. Now I will search for LED. Drag and drop it over here. I will connect the ground, the cathode to ground. I will insert a resistor. Rotated by the key R. Give it a value of 500 ohms. And connect this LED. to pin 2. Similarly, I will connect a green LED. Change this color to green. Also, I will insert a resistor. Press R to rotate. I will just align these components properly so it looks neat and connect this resistor. I will just set this resistor to 500 ohms. So the hardware is complete. Now let's go for the code. I will select text over here. I will delete all the previous code. First, I will initialize my variables. So I will type constant int LED R equal to 2. The red LED is connected to pin number 2. Next, I will say constant int LED G, G for green, equal to 3. Green LED is connected to pin number 3. Next, I will define the delay time. So I will say int delay 
टाइम इक्वल टू हंड्रेड मिली सेकेंड्स नेक्स्ट आई विल गेट गो टू वॉइड सेटअप एंड डिक्लेयर पिन नंबर टू एंड थ्री एज आउटपुट पिन सो आई विल यूज द कमांड पिन मोड एल ई डी आर कॉमा आउटपुट नाउ आई विल सेट ग्रीन एल ई डी दैट इज पिन नंबर थ्री एज एन आउटपुट पिन सो आई से पिन मोड एल ई डी जी जी फॉर ग्रीन एज एन आउटपुट पिन नेक्स्ट आई विल गिव द कमांड सीरियल डॉट बिगिन नाइंटी सिक्स हंड्रेड बेसिकली दिस कमांड स्टार्ट द सीरियल कम्युनिकेशन एंड नाइंटी सिक्स हंड्रेड इज द बॉड रेट बॉड रेट डिफाइन्स द स्पीड एट विच द कम्युनिकेशन टेक्स प्लेस now i will use the command serial dot print ln the red led is blinking this command will print the statement the red led is blinking on the serial monitor print ln signifies print new line so after this statement is printed the cursor will go on the new line next i will use a for loop for int i equal to 1 i less than or equal to 10 i plus plus now i'm using the command serial dot print basically this command will print blink number on the serial monitor next i'll use the command serial dot print ln i i want the blink number to be displayed on the screen and ln will take the cursor to the new line now i will use the command digital write led r comma hi basically this command will write a logic hi to led r now i'll use the command delay thou delay 
and now I'll use the variable name delay time instead. Delay time. So this will give a delay time of 100 milliseconds. Next, I will give the command for digital write LED R comma. Now I'll give it as low. Basically, this section of the program will make my red LED blink 10 times and every 10 times it will give the blink number. Let's see if this code works. So the red LED is blinking. To view the serial monitor, I will go to code and click on serial monitor. So the statement is coming, red LED is blinking and the blink numbers are coming on the serial monitor. Okay, so this part of my code is working. I will click on stop simulation, go to code and I will improvise my program. Now I will write the code for the green LED to blink. So I will just copy this section. Paste it over here. And I will say now green LED is blinking. And I will change the variable name to LED G. Similarly over here. I will change the variable name to LED G. I will say start simulation. So red LED is blinking, green LED is blinking, red is blinking, green is blinking 10 times. Okay, so this is how you can simultaneously view on the serial monitor what action is going on. This feature is used for rapid prototyping. Whenever you are developing a prototype, this feature is very helpful. You can also use the serial monitor to give inputs. We will see that how to do in the next video. Now we will see how this code runs in Arduino IDE. First I will copy this code. I will go to Arduino IDE. Create a new file. Paste the code over here. Click on save as. And I will give the name. Use of for loops and serial monitor. I'll click on save. Already my board is connected to port 4 and Arduino Uno is selected. I will verify the code for errors. So it says compiling sketch. Now I will upload the code to my board. The code has done uploading. First let's see what my serial monitor says. So it's saying red LED is blinking 1, 2, 3, 4, 10. Green LED is blinking blink number 1, 2, 3, 4, 10. So it is telling me what the Arduino is doing at each step. Let's check the hardware output now. So 
so in the hardware i have got this arduino board pin number 2 is connected to the resistor of the red led pin number 3 is connected to the resistor of the green led cathode of both the leds are connected to ground through this red wire let's see how this runs To summarize, in uh, this code, you have learned how to use the serial monitor, you have learned the function serial.begin, here I improvise the program by using variable name for delay time, then you learned the command serial.println ln signifies new line you learned the command serial dot print plain print indicates the cursor at the end of printing blink number does not go to the new line here again i'm using serial dot print ln ln stands for new line so it will print the number and the cursor will go to the new line the rest of the program remains the same and uh, note how my program is indented i have used tab to indent the program so that anyone else who wants to learn the program can read it easily okay so this will be very useful to you when you join any company for homework you can try this task write a program using tinkercad such that Red LED will blink three times, then green LED will blink three times, and then blue LED will blink three times. Each time LED blinks, blink number must be displayed on serial monitor. Connect red LED to pin 2, green LED to pin 3, and blue LED to pin 4. Try this at home.